We're in West Brom, AM EDM. Now, these guys are heavily invested in a handy scan via measurement solutions. Let's go and take a look. Josh, firstly, thanks very much for the invitation to that A&M EDM. Now, we're here on behalf of Measurement Solutions, but can you tell me a little bit more about what you do as a company? Yeah, first of all, thank you for coming down. Uh, A&M EDM started out originally as a spark and wire erosion company around 14 years ago, roughly. Ever since then, through continuous investment, we've managed to become a fairly medium-sized manufacturing business in the heart of the Midlands. Uh, we mainly specialize in EDM and wire erosion, but also have a fairly large CNC machining and turning section, including surface grinding, cylindrical grinding as well, tool making, and many other applications that we can give to our customers. And typically, what type of uh, sectors do you work in? We deal with quite a few sectors in the industry, including aerospace, Formula One, anything down to press tools and whatnot. We're fairly versatile in that regard, so anything that the customer would like making, we can essentially pretty much make it. So we're in your fantastic quality and inspection room here, and on behalf of Measurement Solutions, you've invested in the HandyScan 3D700. Could you tell us a little bit more why you've invested in that? Well, after looking at various other uh, solutions on the market, we found that the HandyScan was the best for us because it gave us the versatility to be able to move it around and whatnot. If you've got a customer who has a job that they require scanning that they can't move or send to us for some reason, we then have the ability to go over to them, scan it, give them all the 3D models that they need and all the results that they need and come back. No hassle and no fuss. Now obviously th there's software involved with that. What, what are you using and how does it work with the existing software that you have? Well along with Creaform's VX model, uh, we have also hev heavily invested in Dellcam's PowerShape and PowerMill. So we have our CAD and CAM packages there, which we can also interface with the handy scan itself in order to achieve the best results. Obviously with some of the parts that you're producing here, you could use CMMs, you could use other devices. Um, so the benefit, what you're saying to us, is, is that the handy scan gives you that flexibility to, to actually sort of take uh, the scanning to the product. Uh, what other benefits, Josh? Essentially, with your CMM machine, nothing will ever beat it for accuracy. But the handy scan is a really good solution if you've got various parts with complex 3D forms, such as these parts over here. And you can get a point graph from a CMM, but that's never going to be as good as a mesh model generated from the actual item itself. The reverse engineering applications on it are absolutely phenomenal, and also size measuring and whatnot. Where your CMM might fall short, the handy scan is there to bring it up and so you can give the customer the best solution for their needs. Now, when you think about learning, obviously you have to go on courses. How easy was it to actually learn to use this device? The handy scan is a very easy to use product, truth be told. I was amazed by the ease of use, as we were referred to it as virtual painting. It's essentially points at the item that you want to scan and it does the work for you. The hard part is involved in modifying the mesh in order to uh, use it for other applications such as CAM packages and whatnot. But with the skills and the software that we've got here, we are able to pretty much generate anything that you want from that model. And obviously if you are stuck with a component or, or the actual uh, software, what sort of backup do you get from Measurement Solutions? Measurement Solutions offer a helpline which is available on call. So if we ever run into any issues, we can ring them straight up and one of their representatives will be on the phone straight away. No hassle, no fuss. And could you give us a little bit of a demonstration? Yeah, that's fine, no worries. So we've calibrated the scanner now, configured it to the surface color and applied the calibration dots and we're now ready to scan. So Josh, can you put the dots wherever you want to see the actual item uh, on the actual screen? Calibration dots are essentially there so the system knows where it is in relation to the surface of the part itself. Uh, they act as essentially as mini datums. The beauty of this is that it allows you to pick the part up itself, move it around, hold it whilst you're scanning, and it will always go back to its known location. How do you know how far to actually hold the actual scanner? As you can see on the screen here, uh, the VX software has been made really well for user friendliness and whatnot, where here you should be able to see a little colored bar. 
red indicates too close, green indicates the ideal distance that you want to be away from the part, and blue is too far. It will still achieve scan results, even if you are a bit too close or a bit too far. Uh, doesn't necessarily have any effect on the actual um, accuracy of the pass scan or of the mesh. It's more there just as a rough guideline of where the scanner is optimum taking its scan from. And how long would this part take you to measure? Roughly about half an hour scanning and about 20 minutes playing around with the mesh in order to achieve optimal results. And in relation to a CMM, time-wise? Much quicker, much quicker. If you have complex surfaces, this is the way forward compared to using a CMM machine, in my opinion. The CMM will always maintain better accuracy, but considering we're able to hold 30 microns tolerance on the handy scan itself, for what you're actually generating, that's brilliant in my opinion. So Josh, I can see how flexible, how easy, but to sum up, why have you bought this? Essentially, we've purchased the HandyScan 700 because of its versatility and its accuracy for such a compact product. The fact that we're able to take it to different companies, scan parts to them without them having to even leave the building is, is brilliant in my opinion. And the fact that we're able to hold it to 30 microns tolerance is pretty outstanding in my eyes. S still not CMM accuracy, but the ability to inf interface your CMM data with the 3D mesh model is something that really sets this product out from any, anything on the market in my opinion.